Right after the release of the Ryzen 7000 series, AMD unveiled the 3D models, which are some of the strongest gaming CPUs currently out there. While there is no doubt about the performance of these CPUs, where are the G-Series APUs? Turns out, AMD is set to release Ryzen 6000G and 7000G pretty soon. In this video, we are going to talk about everything we know about these next-gen APUs to give you a brief idea about what to expect. Let's dive in. Looking for an animation studio that can turn your story or idea into animated visuals? Look no further than 10 Studio. Our team of experts creates animated explainer videos that simplify complex ideas and bring your message to life. Our experience can help you tell your story in a way that engages your target audience and makes them remember it. Don't miss out on this opportunity to stand out from your competition. Visit our website to know more at www.10.studio. News regarding the upcoming G-Series chip comes from renowned leaker 9550 Pro on Twitter, who noticed that there are actually three variants of AM5 chips, which were leaked in last year's Gigabyte hack. Here, the Type 2 chips are the already released 7000X chips, whereas the Type 1 and Type 3 are possibly the 7000G and 6000G series APUs, respectively. We have also got a brief look at the specs of these chips, and putting together additional leaks and rumors, here's how it might turn out to be. First and foremost, these upcoming G-Series APUs are said to replace the Vega iGPU architecture with RDNA 2 and RDNA 3 models, which performance-wise have the ability to outcompete even the GTX 1650 discrete GPU. Aside from that, they are rumored to be compatible with DDR5 memory modules as well. This is a huge plus, given how iGPUs heavily rely on RAM and its bandwidth. While all desktop CPUs containing the Zen 4 cores now come with iGPU, they are far weaker compared to the upcoming RDNA-powered APUs. Take the 700M models, for example. On WCCF Tech's 3 d Mark Time Spy testing, it comes quite close to the RTX 2050 mobile chip, surpassing the GTX 1050 Ti and previous 680M iGPUs in the process. So we can expect quite the performance from the upcoming 7000G and 6000G APUs, at least for portable gaming. That's right, gaming laptops as well as handhelds will go through massive performance bumps, as most of them will have these APUs underneath their hood. Imaging gaming on a handheld with desktop 1650-like performance. So when can we expect these next-gen APUs to arrive? Well, as of now, there are no official announcements or confirmed release dates yet. But according to the leaks surrounding them, you can expect them to arrive by quarter four of this year. As they are done showing off and releasing most of their high-end chips, it is time for the G-Series APUs to arrive. We will be back again with more updates and benchmarks on the 7000 G APUs as soon as they hit the shelves. So that was all about the upcoming AMD Ryzen 7000G APUs. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and comment below to let us know your thoughts. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon if you want to see more videos like this on your feed.